sharp, alert, at ease, and energetic are just some of the ways to describe the feeling that you get when you drink matcha tea. Plus, it's good for you. Be refreshed, get ready to amaze yourself and your friends, because I'm going to show you not only how to make matcha tea, but I'm also going to tell you about the extraordinary health benefits of this powerful little leaf. Unlike commercial green tea, when you drink matcha, you actually ingest the entire leaf, thus taking advantage of getting more chlorophyll, which is a body detoxifier, more catechins, which actually search out dangerous free radicals in the body, thus making it cancer preventing, and antioxidants. And here's a cool fact. By weight, matcha actually contains more antioxidants than blueberries, wolfberries, spinach, orange juice, and pomegranates. The concentration of the antioxidant EGCG you get when you ingest matcha is actually up to 137 times greater than the amount of EGCG you would get from drinking other commercially available green teas. The benefits do not stop with matcha. Matcha is high in fiber, it boosts your energy, it stimulates your mind, it detoxifies your body, it'll help you lose weight, and it's been my secret to anti-aging. But enough already, I want to show you just how simple it is to make a cup of matcha tea. You'll want to preheat your matcha bowl by filling it about one third full of hot water. Add the whisk by dipping in the ends to soften it. Set aside two and a half ounces of hot water for your matcha. Once the bowl is heated, remove the whisk, pour out the water, dry your matcha bowl, and using a traditional bamboo scoop, you'll want to scoop in about two scoops of matcha. Sifting the matcha will eliminate any clumps. Add it to the bowl. and then add your hot water. Take the whisk, and this is the fun part. When whisking your matcha, you wanna make sure you use your wrist, not your arm, and just make little W shapes. You'll want to whisk it until it's nice and frothy at the top with little bubbles. So there are a lot of variants you can do with the recipes for matcha. You can add milk, soy milk, sweeteners, my favorite is almond milk and honey. Once it's nice and frothy on the top, you can remove your whisk. And there you have it, perfect matcha bowl. Let's try it. Mmm, that is good matcha. It's just that simple. Unlock the power of matcha today. Visit matchanatural.com or call our 24-hour hotline at 1-800-515-5035. Live and feel great.